Well, more than 100 or so parents showed up to tonight's board meeting, some with strong opinions about why they think racial sensitivity should be taught in the classroom. Others argue the curriculum would be too politically charged. This debate all started after parents discovered a video on the learning platform Brain Pop, which talks about the Black Lives Matter movement. <laughs> Tense moments outside the Sarasota County Schools District Headquarters. Moments before Tuesday night's board meeting. <laughs> Parents at odds over how racial sensitivity should be taught inside the classroom. I want to encourage the board to enhance cultural sensitivity and racial bias training for our educators and staff. Not get rid of it simply because these conversations can be hard or uncomfortable because these conversations are essential. We were told last meeting, Dr. Asplin, transparency, that we were removing the BLM curriculum. The curriculum she's talking about is this video. During an arrest, Officer Derek Chauvin pulled Mr. Floyd to the ground. Chauvin knelt on his neck and stayed there for close to nine minutes. The 10 minute video discusses the recent civil unrest and talks about Breonna Taylor and Trayvon Martin. Black Lives Matter grew into a movement, raising awareness about senseless deaths that might otherwise have gone unnoticed. The video is available on a site called Brain Pop. It's a service teachers and students can use with an array of lessons on different subjects. According to the district, the video is marked sensitive, which means it's blocked from being viewed inside any school, but can be viewed on a student's home network. As the superintendent explains, Brain Pop is independent of the district, and therefore the district has no control over content. We can only regulate our school system. We can only manage the materials that are on our school devices and our networks. And the district says they aren't aware of any teachers showing this video to their class. If they would like to, they can put in a request to do so. Part of that request would require parents' permission. Reporting in Sarasota, Jordan Bowen, Fox 13 News.